Good morning, this is Granny Fisher, and uh, my husband and I milk two goats twice a day, and today I'm going to show you how we handle milk. This is our milk pail, it's stainless steel. You want to use stainless steel or glass with anything having to do with your milk. It stays cleaner that way and more sanitary. We milk with the machine, but this morning my husband was having a little bit of trouble with the milking machine, so part of this was milked by machine and part by hand. Now, to put up your milk, you need glass jars, a funnel, and a clean cloth. You can use a wash rag, or in this case, I've got some cheesecloth that I use for straining berries when I'm making uh, jelly, straining cheese when I'm making cheese and I use it for straining the milk. And you want to strain the milk to make sure you get out any uh, debris, any little bits of manure, or hair, or anything like that because you're actually taking it from the goat. Okay, now we do clip our goats so there's not as much hair to worry about and we wash the teats before we milk so there's not as much debris. But it always pays to strain. That's my husband's ham radio in the background, if you hear that. Okay. And you can see, I don't know if you can see this, but there's a little bit of debris on that cloth. So you always want to strain your milk. And this is how much we're getting. It, this is a half gallon mason jar, and we're getting about this much every milking. So that is a little shy of three quarts a day from two goats. Now, uh, they were kind of cast off goats when we got them, so this is not what I would consider superior production. But it's milk, it's good milk, and we get it every day. And then you just put this straight in the refrigerator. This is Granny Fisher, I'll see you next time.